Welcome to month six of training, CPA plus email marketing. Why email marketing? For the past 20 years online, email has been the number one traffic source for all successful marketers. What you are going to learn in this month's training, you will learn how to build high converting landing pages. You will learn how to drive traffic on autopilot using social media plus solo ads. You will learn how to build up your email list that will be used to market CPA offers to. You will learn how to automate the process plus more. Our focus for this month's training will be to build up an email list using social automation and solo ads, then market offers to that email list. With this method, you can use an HQ template or you can use a direct CPA offer. Join AdWork Media. You can also use CPA Grip HQ templates. Okay, here we go, so let's begin. Step one, choose your niche. Okay, so when it comes to actually choosing a niche for whatever you are gonna run with, you have to think of what kind of people you, you are willing to deal with. What kind of people do you wanna deal with in the long run? Do you want to deal with people in the make money niche, in the weight loss niche? What niche do you want to deal with? So basically how I usually do this is I usually find the CPA offer first. So I'll think of the HQ template that I'm gonna get create with CPA Grip, or what I will do is I will go to AdWork Media and I will find an offer within a specific niche and then that will be my niche. So let's, so let's say I go to AdWork Media and find an offer that pays $3 per conversion in the insurance space. Well, I already know that if you got a high EPC and the offer is performing well, then I will want you know, the insurance space to be my chosen niche. So whenever it comes to choosing a niche, look at, look at or think about the CPA offer or a content locker, the HQ template that you're gonna create first before you even choose your niche because you will already know and that will position you on how the money will be made. Let's say if you say you wanna choose a niche, a specific niche, and there's no hot offers in that niche. Well, if that's the case, then your money will not you know, roll in and you won't make any money at all. So you definitely want to choose a niche that has hot performing offers inside of like AdWork Media and if you create a PDF HQ template with CPA Grip, you want to think of what kind of content you are gonna lock, what hot training you're gonna lock, what hot tips are you gonna lock, what hot um, you know, um, course are you gonna lock, what hot information are you gonna lock behind the content locker so people want to gain access. So if you want to, let's say if you want to lock a, a Facebook marketing, a Facebook marketing PDF. You want to do um, CPA Grip HQ templates, and let's say you want to lock a, a Facebook marketing PDF. Well, you should already know that internet marketers is going to be your are, are going to be your target. So you want to build a list up of niche targeted internet marketers and people that's into entrepreneurship, people that's into marketing overall, and that will be your that will be your your niche. So you will focus on building your list around those people. So what I'm saying is already have in mind who you are going to deliver to by choosing your offer first. Already know that. So have your offer picked out, go for your audience, and the magic will begin to happen once you begin to mail your audience. Step two, install GMAS. Okay, unless you've been hiding under a rock, you should know about GMAS. GMAS is the latest and hottest way to send emails online. And that's exactly how I've been crushing it with email marketing and CPA offers by using GMAS. GMAS is a simple extension for Google Chrome, for the Google Chrome browser that you can simply add to your Chrome browser and perform marketing like never before. With GMAS, you can send out emails. You can send out anywhere from 50 emails for free all the way up to 500 to 2,000 emails per day paid. So to repeat, you can send out 50 emails per day for free with GMAS. I'm pretty sure they still offer that. All the way up to 2,000 emails, which is 60,000 emails per month on paid levels. With GMAS, you can track 
your email campaigns. You can see in your email campaigns, of course. You can do all of that. All of everything that the big names out there like Aweber and GetResponse can do, you can most likely do it with Gmail straight through Gmail. So all of your emails will be sent directly from a Gmail account. What does this do? This makes you look more personal and professional. See, when you do things like Aweber, like I have an Aweber account, when you send emails from Aweber, it don't look like a personal email. It, it looks too way too professional, actually. You know, you want to look professional, but looking way too professional and robotic can kill your conversions in many ways because it has all the Aweber details at the bottom of the email and have unsubscribe and all of that. You don't want all of that at the bottom of your emails because people will not take you really serious. You know, they will, even though if they take you serious, they see everybody sending those kind of emails from Aweber or get response. So by using something as powerful as GMAS, you are on your way to really crushing it with email marketing. So whenever you are on Google Chrome, what you want to do is you just want to simply click add to Gmail. After you click add to Gmail, they may, they may most likely tell you to upgrade. If you want to send more than 50 emails per day, you're going to have to pay $9 per month. Or if you don't want no watermark, no GMAS watermark, you're going to pay $13 a month. If you want to do auto follow-ups, you're paying $20 a month. You know, this is completely up to you, whichever one you want to roll with. If you want to keep the free level at 50 emails per day, which is 1,500 emails per month, you can if you want to. It's just completely up to you. But remember, if you get any of these three right here, you can see in up to 500 emails per day. And if you go through GMAS's special instructions to install something called G Suite, you can see in 2,000 emails per day. So just know just on a basic level, you're going to see in 500 emails per day as long as you want. And that's the beauty and the power of something like GMAS. So once again, all you got to do is click add to Gmail. After that, it will be instantly installed to your Chrome browser and ready to use and ready to operate like right away. It's super simple to use. Even a 10-year-old, even an 8-year-old can use it, and it's going to blow your mind with its power and how effective it is and will be with your CPA campaigns. Step three, select your offer or set up your HQ template. Okay, so what it's time for is time for me to show you the PDF template, the CPA grip template that I've been talking about. So I'm probably, I'm pretty sure I've showed you this template before, but if you haven't seen it before or don't really remember, I'm about to go over it once again. So if you go to cpagriptemplates.com, you can grab any one of these templates, of course. And the one that we're going to focus on is this beauty right here free ebook download landing page template. That's the one we want because it looks good, it looks professional, and it converts like never before. So I'm logged into my CPA Grip Dummy account over here, and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna click monetization tools and click URL file lockers. After that, I'm gonna click create new, I agree, continue. And we're gonna name this, let me see, Let's see, we're going to name this, let's think of something. Facebook marketing. Let's name this Facebook marketing as if Facebook marketing is our niche. And what we want to do is we want to go over here and find a PDF in Google. Or you can always go to PLR sites. But I'm going to go to Google and type in Facebook marketing PDF. Here we go, we're going to some Facebook, the complete guide to Facebook advertising. I'm going to click on that. And I'm going to copy that link right there. Looks very nice and professional, by the way. I'm going to copy that and I'm going to go over to here. I'm going to click on locked URL. I'm going to paste that link right there. I'm going to click on advanced. I'm going to go to cpagriptemplates.com over here, click read more right beside this nice looking template right here. After that, look how nice it looks, super nice. I'm going to copy the CSS code first. Let's get the CSS. 
Let's scroll down and get the CSS code and paste. Then we'll go down here. Let's copy all of this down here. This is the HTML part we're copying right here. Copy, go down here, paste, refresh, and here we go. Look how gorgeous and quick that is. Super gorgeous template that people will simply land on, click begin download, fill out an offer, and bam, when that happens, you get paid every single time, as you may already know. So let's go over here and we're going to change this little part over here. Let's see. File name, how to make money. Let's click on advance and let's find that. Let's edit that file name. Here we go. There's the file name. We'll just type in Facebook marketing. Facebook marketing PDF. There we go. And simply click create after I click create I can click get link I can click copy and I can check out my gorgeous landing page my gorgeous HQ template as you may already see right here that will be emailed to people whenever they want this kind of freebie whenever they want anything within the marketing niche so whenever I send them their freebie, this is the link that they will get. So if they, if a person gave me their email address to get my Facebook marketing guide, I have them on my list already. Let's say if I have 10 people or 100 people or, or 5,000 people and beyond, all of those people are going to get this beautiful landing page right here that they will simply land on, they will click begin download, they will fill out an offer, and we are paid every single time that happened. And that's exactly how this works and why it's so powerful. So imagine building up your email list consistently. I mean like 50 to 100 leads rolling in per day and with multiple traffic sources. You can easily do that. I do it every single day. 50 to 100 leads on autopilot every single day. Coming into my email list, joining my email list, and I can send those people whatever I want. And, you know, sometimes it's much more than that, but that, that's just a very, very, very slow day. You know, sometimes you got four or five hundred people in a single day. If you are a person like me and have a, you know, a nice reach online, there's tons of people that join your email list every single day that you can send them whatever you want. In our case, we are going to send them just what they're looking for hiding behind a beautiful PDF HQ template. That's exactly how this is going to work with CPA Grip. With AdWork Media, it's going to work a little bit different. But as you can see, with CPA Grip, it's super simple. And I wanted to show you exactly how to create your PDF style template with CPA Grip. And this is exactly how you do it. Okay, as you can see, I'm right here on my inside of my AdWork Media account. And they have some pretty impressive offers. AdWork Media is great because they convert like crazy. Of course, CPA Grip converts also like crazy. But when you can send somebody a direct link and all they have to do is click on that link, enter their email, and you get paid, a lot of times that converts better than HQ templates. But it also depends on who's receiving the email. Since we are doing email marketing this month, the sky is truly the limit because we can email these offers if it's within our niche all day long. One offer that I have my eye on right here is Survey Junkie. I have my eye on it because I promote Survey Junkie in a few of my other accounts. So this is an offer that converts like crazy and you get paid 88 cent every single time an offer is completed. So let's do the math here. Let's say if we convert a thousand people a month. Well, if we make 88 cent a pop, we make $880 a month off of just Survey Junkie. Let's say if we convert a thousand people on this offer right here, we make around $1,900 a month. This one right here, around $2,700 per month is what we will make 
by simply converting a thousand people per month on this offer right here. If you are in a niche like this, and this is the survey niche, so people that want to get deals and make money um, like a side income and all of that, that's a massive space. So you have an unlimited reach. And, and I mean really an unlimited reach on social media and with solo ads. You have an unlimited reach when it comes to reaching people that will fill out this offer right here. Every time it's filled out, you get paid two dollars and seventy six cent every single time that's filled out. Even even just think, even converting ten people a day is twenty seven dollars every single day you will make. And let's do the math on that per month. Eight hundred and ten dollars per month. Just ten people per day on this offer right here will make you on average around eight hundred and ten dollars per month with AdWork Media. Please understand how serious that is. That is some very, very serious money if you are a person that's working a job and just want a side income, or even if you don't have a, a job at all, 800 extra, 800 extra dollars per month is a pretty nice income if you ask me if you're making it on the side and you know if you're making it through something like CPA marketing. So by using the power of AdWork Media, it's up to you with what you want to choose to promote. But just understand that the sky is the limit. The EPC over here is earnings per click on average, how much you will earn every time your link, your CPA link is clicked. Of course, you will have to convert the person, but on average, you earn 51 cent every time your link is clicked with this offer right here. And of course, the all CPA networks, you know, measure that out and let you know how much on average you're earning every time your link is clicked. But there's some high converting offers right here inside of AdWork Media. Here go to Survey Space right here also. Here go Survey Junkie right here also. So the top three offers, this is a beautiful thing right here and it tells you a whole lot. The top three offers inside of AdWork Media is the survey niche. So if you are inside of the survey niche, if you are within that space, you best believe you're going to hit the ground running and most likely start making money right away. You know, like it's no guarantee, but entering into this space is showing us like crazy how much money people are making within this space because of the high EPCs and the high payouts right here every time a conversion fires off. And all you have to do is simply... Choose your link. Let's click on a survey, survey junkie. Choose whichever offer you want. As you can see, a nice little landing page right here. Take surveys, get paid. And you scroll down and you simply copy that link. And that's it. This will be the email. You can use a short uh, a URL shortener like SmartShare if you want to. And you will shorten your URL just to track the clicks. Or you can, of, of course, allow, allow AdWork Media to track the clicks. You type up your email, you include this link, and bam, there you go. Your CPA offer that paid that, that you get paid 88 cent for every conversion, your CPA offer is sent to your list. Now imagine having a list of 10,000 people and converting. Remember, these people don't have to spend a dime whenever you send them this and they complete the offer. Imagine having a list of 10,000 people and converting just 1,000 people. In a single day, you make eight hundred and eight hundred and eighty dollars. I believe it to be roughly eight hundred and eighty dollars in a single day. Even once again, if you've done it over a month's time, over a thirty-day period, that's still a pretty good income. When of course you started with this method from scratch, it's a beautiful thing. And AdWork Media is a beautiful place to be if you want some very, very extremely powerful CPA offers. Remember, doing a mix of the methods that you learn within my mastermind, I made nearly $100,000 with it with just this one dummy account right here that is now my demo account. I made nearly $100,000 with this one account, so the sky is truly the limit with the method that I'm teaching you right here in month six. So yeah, I just wanted to show you exactly how each offer looks and you know how you can choose your offer inside of AdWork Media because once you are ready to hit this step in and of course choose your offer because whenever you choose your offer that will most likely determine what niche you're going to be involved in 
if you're in the survey space, you know, you can, it's broad. You can be in a make money niche. People just look for extra income. But I just wanted to show you exactly how this looked, how this worked, and how you can just go in once you're accepted into AdWork Media, choose your offer, copy your link, email your link, and watch the money start to roll in. And it's honestly as simple as that. Step four, create your landing page. So let's go ahead and get a landing page created right now. I don't know if you, um, if I've mentioned it or not, but I use Google Sites a lot now. So you go to sites.google.com and you can create very professional landing pages for 100% free. So I use Google Sites a whole lot now. So right here in month six, that's exactly what we are gonna be doing. We're gonna be creating a, a nice, beautiful landing page using Google Sites. So I already have a landing page that I created with Google Sites over here since my niche that I chose is the Facebook marketing niche. Are you ready to make your first thousand dollars on Facebook? And I got a question mark. And as you can see, the, the landing page is very simple and it's simply a yes or no question. And whenever people click yes, they are directed to enter their email address. Whenever they click no, I haven't chosen yet. I don't believe where they're going to go yet, but you know, these, these are the kind of landing pages that work best and you can choose wherever you want to take your, your traffic whenever they click no thanks. But I'm, I'm sure if they came to your landing page, you know, most people are going to click yes. So that's exactly how it looked, the one that I've set up. And let me show you exactly what's going to happen here. So whenever somebody click yes, I'm ready, they are redirected over here to Google Forms. And Google Forms is going to store all of the emails, and this is going to connect to Google Spreadsheets. And Google Spreadsheets connects to um, GMAS, and you're going to see exactly how all of this works. So basically, this is not an automated process. So whenever people enter their email right here, we have to manually go and send them emails. So all of our new leads that we get with um, that land in our Google Spreadsheet, we're, we're going to have to manually send these people emails to enter their email address. Of course, if you have something like MailChimp or Aweber, you can automate this whole process, but the, the, the cost of it is going to be 10 to 20 times more per month. With, you know, GMAS, you're only paying like, you know, between $9 and $13 a month and $20 if you want to, you know, have the best package. But that's as, that's as much as you're paying. You know, that's the most you're paying every single month, anywhere from 9 to $20 versus Aweber. You're going to pay anywhere from $80 to a few hundred dollars once you start getting so many emails in and start sending so many emails out. So I definitely highly recommend that you use GMAS and, you know, connect it with Google Spreadsheet and Google Forms like I'm doing right here. So basically what people will do is they will simply enter an email and that, that email will be stored. So people, whenever they enter their email, people won't receive an automated email of the CPA offer from from you so what you have to do is once you get so many emails that land in google spreadsheet and you're going to see exactly how the spreadsheets work in a minute once you get so many emails you can just say okay i got 300 leads now it's time to send, send them the cpa offer or send them a cpa offer or i got 500 leads now it's time to mail them an offer that's how you got to do it you got to manually do it when you're doing it this way so once again after a person clicks yes i'm ready they will be redirected over here to enter their email because these are people that saying yes I'm ready to receive the guide or the training or whatever it may be on how to make you know my first thousand dollars on Facebook and uh, once again if they click no you can take them wherever else you want to take them and I even put good luck with life right here just to make people really think so let's go over here so whenever let's say I have 300 leads right now that people you know people that say yes this is what I'm going to send them right here. This is the PDF right here that I'm going to send them. As you may already know, you send me, you see, you watch me create this. This is a HQ template of the Facebook guide, guide that I found, you know, on Google. So I locked that guide and I'm sending this guide right here. So I'll just simply have the landing page. They enter their email from there. After I get so many leads, I'm going to send them this offer right here because that's exactly what they asked for. And on the landing page, you know, I could have included this. Um, this training will be ready on a specific day, so they won't think they're going to get it immediately. Because if I have one lead, I'm not just going to, you know, send out an email blast, which is one person on the list. 
I will send it after I get so many, you know, after I get maybe 100, 200, 300 people. And, you know, you, you, you're basically telling people they're not, to not expect the God immediately. Because if they expect it immediately and you don't send it immediately, they won't trust you. So you want to definitely put on your landing page somewhere that you'll receive this guide in 30 days or in, you know, in one week, one week after you submit your email, just something like that, just to let them know. So that's how the landing page look. And of course, once again, I'm going to send them the HQ template. If you have a good um, offer, any good offers with AdWork Media, you can also do that. But when it comes to trainings and guides and stuff like that, I highly recommend that you use this PDF Downloads HQ template with CPA Grip. Okay, so let's go ahead and um, start creating a landing page live. Let me let me just show you how to do this. Let me show you how to do a live. So once again, you go to sites.google.com and you will click this little plus sign down here at the bottom. Okay, we are right here on Google Sites now, and we are in the mood to where you begin creating your landing page. So let me show you exactly how this works. You can choose a theme. First thing you want to do is go ahead and choose a theme. You can do that right here. You can choose whichever one of these themes you want. I'm sure you've probably seen me do this before, but I'm going to go ahead and do it again. That's a nice looking theme right there. Let's see this one. This is a nice looking theme right here. Just whichever one you want to, whichever one you want to choose. That's a cool one. I like this one right here. This is the one you just see me use. And let's say we're gonna go ahead and roll with this one right here. I could just put, and this is just a, of course, a, for example, you know, as an example, how to make 1,000 per day on Instagram. Okay, and you always wanna to try to roll with the theme too, like the social, um, the social network theme, whatever the social um, network may be, you want to roll with the theme. IG God. Okay, let me see. You could change that header type. Let's see. Title only. I can just put title only if I want to. You go ahead and make sure that's centered. Okay, that should be centered. Let me see the font. I'm going to change the. Um, the color of the font, let's see. Let's just say we're gonna leave it like that. Let me, this ain't the best looking um, landing page, but just for, just so you can see how it works. Let me go right here and, and let's choose this layout right here. We always want to, you always want to choose this layout right here because it gives people the yes or no option. And I found this to work three or four times better than any other landing page when you basically are telling people that they're going to be able to get something for free and they can choose, yes, I want it for free or no, I don't want it. You know, it's completely up to them, but why would they come to your landing page and, you know, and, and say they want something if they don't? So most people are going to click yes, and that's when they are redirected to the Google Forms. So let's find two nice photos right here. Yes, send me the guy. No thanks. Put yes, send me the guy, and then no thanks. Let's make sure that's good. So I'll go to Google and, and I'll put successful entrepreneur just trying to find two photos. Let's see. Okay, here go the first photo. Let's see, upload. Let's see, here go the second photo. There we go, both photos are now uploaded. Text right here, you don't have to enter no text right there if you don't want to. Or you can just put, after you submit your email, your guide will be sent within 30 days. And, or you can say within seven days or whatever. Your free guide, let's see, because it's free, it don't matter how long they have to wait, to be honest, because it's, it's free. So, you know, it's up to them if they want to enter their email. Okay, let's make sure that's good right there. And we'll go ahead and create our Google form. Let's publish this real quick, just to 
make sure to save. IG guide is the name. Publish is super simple, of course, but it's just for this video. Of course, you want to take a little bit more time with it, but just for this video, I'm going to keep it simple. See, look at this. How to make $1,000 per day on Instagram. Go down here, and this is all it will basically be. Yes, see me to God, that will be clickable, or no thanks. You don't have to make that clickable if you don't want to because you have to have somewhere to take them to anyways if, if they click no thanks. You know, you can, you can send them to a video just trying to talk to them and, and basically try to fill them out to see, you know, wh why they feel the way they feel. Why would they come to a landing page and click no thanks? So you can just do whatever you want to right there. But this is it right here. So what we'll do right now is we'll go to Google Forms. Okay, let's type in Google Forms right here. Let's see, once we go to Google Forms, let me show you exactly how this is going to work. And you will go to google.com forward slash forms. After that, click go to forms. Then once you get here, as you can see, I got all, all types of forms created. And I could just start with a blank one or I can just start with one of these templates. But what I'm going to personally do is, let me see, contact information. Now, I'm, I'm going to just, I'm just probably roll with a blank one. I'm going to roll with a blank form just like this. And I could put Instagram guy. Or I could put enter your email. Let me see. I put enter your email below to access this guide. So of course you don't see any email place. Let me see. Let me collect email. Okay. What you want to do is you want to click this little thing right up here and just click collect email addresses. Click save and there we go. This question down here, we don't really need to ask them any questions. There we go. So this is all you'll need right here. Your responses will be right here and I'll show you exactly how that works. But I'll click send, get the link. I can shorten the URL, click copy, and I'll go over here to my landing page. So I'll click yes, see me to God like that. I'll highlight it like that. And I'll click this little link right here, the little insert link. Do that, apply. And once again, you can put whatever you want to right there on new things, but I'm going to just click publish. So it should be good to go. It should be published. So let me refresh this. Okay, let me see. Let's see, let's see. Publish. Let's publish it again. View. It may take a few minutes for an update. Okay, there we go. Yes, see me to God. After that, they will be redirected to enter their email address and click submit. And you are simply telling the people that after you submit your email, your free guide will be sent within 30 days. So they, they know they're not going to you know receive it instantly. You can even put somewhere that you are working on creating the guide and it's just kind of like a, a countdown. Like people are lined up waiting on the guide to, to be released and for it to drop. You can even do it like that if you want to. So let's make sure we got everything over here. We can name this form. This is name Instagram guy. They gave me a name. Click send. Let's publish it again. Let's see. Copy. I don't even think you got to do all this just to publish it. I think, you know, Google, I'm pretty sure Google is smart enough to automatically publish the, the updated name Instagram guy. Okay. So. Let me show you how this is going to work. I'm going to show you right here. So let's go over here. Let's leave it. So what, right now what we're about to do is we're about to walk through the whole process and I'm going to show you exactly how all of this is going to work. It's a very smooth process and once you begin to really um, go through it daily and use it daily, it's, it'll become like second nature to you and it'll be very simple like it is for me. 
So let's say you have somebody land on your landing page, just like I'm on here right now, and they will click Send Me the Guide. After they click Send Me the Guide, let me put a dummy email, test at gmail.com, click Submit. It says, your response has been recorded. So what will happen now? We will go to Google Forms. This is going to happen whenever your leads start submitting email, their email address. Let's go to Google Forms, google.com forward slash forms. Go to Forms. Okay, Instagram Guide. Click on that. And we will click on, we will check responses. See, one. It says number one right there because there's one response. I just enter my email address. Whenever you have more responses, this number will automatically update. So if you have 500 leads, it's going to update to 500. If you have 1,000 leads, it's going to say 1,000 instead of one, of course. So what you would do to begin mailing people, and after you already have GMAS completely installed, is you would click on responses, and you would click right here, create spreadsheet. And you can name your spreadsheet. I'm going to leave this one right here, Instagram, um, Instagram Guide Responses. And I will click Create. Then I will head over to, hold up, see? Test at gmail.com and put it in a Google spreadsheet. Then I will head over to Gmail. Let's go over to Gmail. Okay, whenever I go over to Gmail, what, all I would have to do is I will simply click, let me show you. As you can see, I got a ton of emails right here with using GMAS. It's my GMAS report. It's the email I just now sent out right there. Okay, so once you have GMAS installed, you will have these two little things up here, the little, um, the little email thing, like the little email envelope and the, the Google spreadsheet. The Google Spreadsheet um, button right there. You will click on the Google Spreadsheet button. And then you will find the Google Spreadsheet, the um, Instagram Guide Responses. There it is. Instagram Guide Responses. And then after you choose it, connect to Spreadsheet. After that, you will simply be ready. You, you'll be ready. Like, like I have one lead right here, which is to test the email. Let's say if I had a thousand leads, it would have loaded a thousand people right there within seconds. And all you have to do is go ahead and put your subject line. Okay, so what I put is, let's say I have all of my leads and I just load, you know, loaded all of my leads just like you just watched me do. I put, hey, as the subject line. Or you could put, um, here goes your free guide that you requested. I put, hey, as the subject line. And I put, hey, I see that you opted into my email list for my free Instagram guide. The guide is now ready so you can download it now. And what I did is I selected download it now and I click the little link button so it will make download it now clickable. And just for this uh, this training, I just put google.com, but that will be your HQ template. So imagine having a list, an email list build up of thousands of people and you, you're, you're ready to send an email and you actually send this email out. Can you imagine how many times it's going to convert? This is all you have to do in order to start mailing your people with GMAS, all of your leads. This is how you will mail every single lead with GMAS. And the beautiful thing about it is once you have GMAS installed, you can click on this up arrow right here. And you can, if you um, if you have GMAS's biggest package, you can do auto follow-up. So all of the people that you email, you can click auto follow-up right here. And you can tell it, okay, after two days, if no, if no reply, 
I'll send uh, another email and after three days and so on. And you can automatically send people an email that didn't reply to the email or didn't open the email or didn't or people that didn't click your CPA link. It's just completely up to you, but you can auto follow up with all of your people if you have Gmail's um, Gmas's twenty dollar a month package. I personally don't have it yet because I got so many Gmas accounts, and of course that will be you know it's a ton of money if I have ten twenty dollar a month accounts. So I, I just don't have it yet, but I'm eventually going to get it myself, and I do manual follow ups. So how you do that is, and you can check out all of the other settings you know right here on Gmas once you click that up arrow. But let me show you how you do the um, the, auto, the, um, the manual follow-ups. So you would click this little this little email looking thing, this little envelope. You would click that, and it will load. Look, choose a past campaign to send a manual follow-up campaign. So I got to do, and I can just choose one, and I can click compose. There we go. So it's ready to follow up with the people that you have already sent an email to in the past and that's all you have to do in order to follow up with leads that you've already sent your CPA offer to or your HQ template to or whatever you may have sent them. But as you can see, setting up your landing page is a very, very simple process and you want to keep it as simple as possible. This right here is an ugly landing page, but I've found and you know, many, you know, huge companies have found that the ugliest websites and landing pages convert best. I guess because people don't like, they're intimidated by things that's too professional. So even though this is an ugly landing page right here, you best believe it's going to convert well because all people got to do is simply click yes, send me the guide and they will be and they will be redirected to enter their email address and you already see how that whole entire flow goes. So what I just showed you is how to create your landing page and how to connect your landing page to Google Forms to collect to, to build your email list up and then how to connect Google Forms to Google Spreadsheets and then Google Spreadsheets to GMAS in order to start mass emailing all of your leads whenever you build up your list. This is exactly how it goes and this is all you'll need to do in order to have people landing your landing page and sending out those CPA offers and HQ templates all day, every day around the clock. Step five. Find something to give away for free if you choose CPA Grip HQ templates. Okay, so when it comes to finding your freebie, you can do one of the three things. One, create it yourself. If you're a person that know how to create products, like PDF products, write ebooks, or or you like to go to hirewriters.com and have somebody else write an ebook for you, or go to freelancer dot com and have somebody else you know um, create a PDF for you or a training guide for you you know you can do that you can create this yourself or you can outsource it and have it created that way two find a popular blog post and I'm sure you've heard me talk about this you know many times but if you find let's say you are locking a PDF or locking something to give away with um, with the PDF CPA grip template, if you can find a very popular, helpful blog post that's super popular that your visitors may have not seen yet, but it's within the niche, they will thank you beyond words because this is something that's proven to help people and it's proven that people love it. So if you put that URL, if you hide that URL behind your HQ templates, trust me, people will love you for it. Three, you can go to Google and type your niche PDF. So if your niche is weight loss, you can type weight loss PDF. If, you're, if your niche is Instagram marketing, you can put Instagram marketing PDF. If it's, um, let's see, cryptocurrency, you can put cryptocurrency or crypto PDF or Bitcoin PDF, whatever you want to put. But there's more guides inside of Google than you can ever imagine, like 100% for free. I don't know if they're guides of quality, so you wouldn't. You will have to, you know, of course, go over them yourself because some guides are good, but there's other guides that are very amazing, and you don't want to see in guides that's not all that good or that's misleading. 
to your leads, to your fresh leads. So it's completely up to you if you want to go to Google. And of course, that's the easy and most simple way. But it's completely up to you if you want to go to Google to find your guides instead of creating them yourself or finding a popular blog post. Or last but not least, go to idplr.com or any kind of PLR website and just find hot products. Find hot PDFs to download, of course, idplr.com and other sites just like it. It's not free, but once you create a membership with these guys, and I'm not affiliated with them at all, once you create a membership with them, you will be able to pay a one-time fee and access all of their products. Let's check out some of the products right here. Let's see, with giveaway rights. Ebooks with giveaway rights is what I'm going to check out. And I'll show you exactly what they what they have if you, if you haven't joined yourself. Here we go, how to grow your business with fa with sales, 12 point checklist, kickstart your internet business. Okay, 20 online business ideas. This will be a very, very good PDF right here to give away. So if you become the owner of such product, this will be the perfect thing to, to lock, to put uh, you know behind a content locker and to give away. People would love to have something like this. So IDPLR.com has a ton of PDFs like this with giveaway rights. And of course, if you purchase the rights to give this away, you know, you have the rights to give it away. So you will have access to many different PDF guys, not just, you know, the ones that you've seen on the front page, but look at all of the stuff that you have. Over 6,000 eBooks, over 1,700 videos, 200,000 plus articles, audios, templates, graphics, and so on. So the amount of people that you can pull in by giving stuff like this away for free is just going to be completely crazy. And these are products that's proven to be great. So you best believe you're most likely going to get the best result by using IDPLR.com's products. But if, you're, if, you're, if you've been in the game for a long time and you always create your own ebooks and your own trainings and guides, you can do it yourself so you won't have to you know, pay no fee. But this is some very hot stuff in here that you can give away and it works like crazy and, and I've been giving this stuff away for a few years now and actually about four or five years now. So I know how well it works and I know how well these ebooks convert when you are looking to build your email list. So of course, IDPLR.com is completely optional, but if you want to, if you're a person that's just now start, starting out online and you don't have a lot of money to spend, then I definitely wouldn't recommend you know going with, with um, choice number four because what, what I'm all about, I'm all about helping you save money instead of spend money. So if you can find something on Google for free or if you can find a blog post or create it yourself, always go the, these routes first. You know, always go these routes first because if you just got started online, you don't want to just spend all of your money. You know, it, it's just not fun. It's not a fun thing to do. So if you want to do it the organic way and, and find something on Google or create it yourself, you can, you can do that. And that's completely fine with doing that. But that's all you have to do when you are looking to, you know, give something away. And remember this, if you want to build a relationship with your leads, if you want your leads to love you out the gate, you want to give them something away for free. If you can find another way to do it and, you know, your people still love you for you, you know, for, for, your, for you being you, you can do it that way if you want to. But the smart way is giving something away for free. Trust me, like I, I've been in the game 10 plus years and whenever I give something away for free, it doesn't matter what space I'm in, my leads love me. So that's all I'm telling you. Whenever you are looking for a freebie or whenever you are want to really scale your income up, always give out a freebie if you want the best results. Okay, so you can drive traffic to your landing page using Instagram by simply reposting attractive content plus using powerful hashtags. Okay, so let me go ahead and go through the Instagram strategy that I've been using with this method to grow my following and to grow my leads. So basically, your leads are going to mainly be coming through Instagram if you use this strategy and if you use it consistently. Of course, like I mentioned, you can use many other social platforms. You can do solo ads and all types of things that you want to do to generate leads, but if you want to generate leads on Instagram, this simple method is super powerful and it can have followers and leads coming in like clockwork. So basically, this is a dummy profile, DM Software Club. It's a profile that I made uh, probably a few months ago. 
and I made this and really done nothing with it, so I'm gonna just use this for an example. As you can see, I put a nice, let me, in the bio, in, in my Instagram. So if you make a brand new Instagram account for your landing page, what you want to do is keep it niche targeted. So I'm going to leave this DM software club because I'm using this Instagram account a few places to test some things. But what I'm going to update is I'm going to update the name right here. And I'm going to put ready to master Facebook marketing. Something like that. Let's see. Let's make sure it's not too long. Okay, that's too long. Let me just put FB marketing. Okay, I put ready to master Facebook marketing. I put that so when a new person likes a photo or comes to visits my profile, they will see what it's about like from the start. If they if they answer, they read this and answer the question yes for, for themselves and say, yeah, of course I'm ready to learn Facebook marketing. They will then go down here to the lighter text. This is going to be bold up here where, where I put it in, you know, the name section. It's going to be the bold text right here. Then in the description, I put learn how to make $1,000 plus per day on Facebook. Click the link to access. When I click the link or when the visitor clicks the link, bam. Here go the beautiful landing page that I created. And it's going to say, are you to are, are you? And it's going to say, are you ready to make your first thousand dollars on Facebook? They can either choose yes right here or no right there. And it takes them straight to my landing page. And that's the beautiful thing about it. And this method is super simple. And what we are basically doing is we are staying within our niche and we are searching for niche targeted photos to download them and repost them to our Instagram account. So if I have an Instagram account with no photos, which this one is brand new basically because it only has one photo, what I will simply do is I will, I will search for stuff within my niche. So let me go to Facebook marketing. Facebook marketing. And if I see some, some Facebook marketing style photos, just post them all. Post every single one of them. So I will click on the photo, I will copy the URL up here, and I will go to downloadgram.com. That is download, G R A E M.com. I will put that URL in there, and I will simply download that photo. Okay, as you can see, the image just downloaded. So what I'm doing is I'm just staying within my niche. That's all. If you do recipes, you can um, search hashtag recipes of Instagrams or recipes or chicken recipes or whatever. And you want to download and repost all of those photos to your Instagram, or to your brand new Instagram account just to give it some content and just so you will have things to post. And of course, you want to write a short description with your post. Make sure your profile is on public. Write a short description if you want to and use powerful hashtags. That's all you have to do in order to make this method work. So basically what this is going to do is, and you can tag the user too, like basically I'm just taking photos from other users, but of course you can give credit. Like I can give credit to the original poster because if they find out that you took their photo and reposted it to your account without giving credit, usually they'll have it removed by Instagram. So if you want to tag, I highly recommend that you tag the person Wherever you got the photo from, just tag the person and let them know that the original post poster of the content comes from that specific person, and that will keep you around much longer if you do that. So then what I'll do is I will simply find something else, see? I will find something else to have to do with Facebook or Facebook marketing. And I will come over here again to downloadgram.com. After that, the second image will download and I'm gonna go ahead and post these two uh, to the um, to the Instagram account itself. As you can see, my profile looks a little bit more full now because I've added two more niche targeted photos. These are all photos that has to do with the marketing space or the Facebook space. You know, my, my niche is Facebook marketing. My whole entire goal is to get people on my email list that want to master Facebook marketing or want to start making money with Facebook so they can simply click on my link, enter their email. After I get so many emails, I start sending people the CPA content locker that I created on CPA Grip of the free guide. So that's the whole entire goal. 
but everything looks a little bit more full now and all you have to do is basically do exactly what I've done. Find niche targeted photos, download them on this one right here. I gave credit to the content owner right here, but download those photos. You can go over here to seek metrics and find the most popular hashtags with your niche, within your niche, and, it, and you can just click generate and they will recommend that you you know, choose some other hashtags that's highly related. So you want to do that also, copy about nine or 10 hashtags to post just like I done, to post with your photo. I created, a, I um, wrote out a short description right there. Content owner is tagged right there. Here goes the, here goes the, um, the hashtags right here. And after that, I am ready to roll because what's going to happen is once I start making so many posts within a niche, I'm going to be like an authority figure and people are going to wonder who is this person or who is this profile posting all of these photos and they're going to find us, they're going to discover us through hashtags because I know me personally, I search hashtags daily, so hashtags get searched a whole lot and that's exactly how we get discovered through hashtags. But once you tie everything in together, you know, putting a nice bio, Download and re-upload the photos with hashtags, you know, tagging the owner, putting a short description, uh, putting a link to your landing page, which of course is going to lead to people entering their email and you're going to have the email to send your CPA offers to in your HQ templates. Once you tie everything together like that in, the sky is truly the limit. So once again, let me tell you where the traffic is going to come from. Whenever people are searching for targeted hashtags, if you do recipes, if you're in a fitness space, if you're in the marketing space like myself, that's how you will be discovered. The more posts you make with hashtags, don't use the same hashtags because Instagram would do something called ghosting you because they'll think you're spamming. Mix up the hashtags, switch them around or whatever you have to do. But once you post so many photos with hashtags, you are going to start being discovered. The algorithm is going to recommend that you um, be discovered basically. It's gonna recommend you to others within the niche and people are gonna search for hashtags and you're gonna start showing up at the top of search for those specific hashtags and that's where the power kicks in. But you don't wanna stop there on Instagram. What you also want to do is you wanna find a huge marketer. So in the, um, within your niche, like let me search Alex Becker. I'm sure you know of Alex Becker, I've heard of Alex Becker. Here goes profile. What I want to do is I want to start following people that may have interest in my Facebook guide. So what I'll do is I'll click, I'll click on Alex Becker's latest post and you would do the same with every niche you in. I will click on his latest post. I will simply see how, who these people are that liked his photo right here. And I will start to follow all of these people. Just follow, 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 follow. These are all people that's into marketing that follow Alex Becker. You best believe that. These are most likely marketers and entrepreneurs. So I'll just follow and you can manually do it or you can do it with um, comp, the common tool, whichever one you choose to do. And another thing I was going to tell you about the common tool is if you don't want to go to downloadgram.com because that's how you um, download photos. If you don't want to go to downloadgram.com and download photos, then email them to yourself. And so you can email them to your mobile or whatever you may be doing. You don't have to go through all that if you use the common tool because you can post right on Instagram from your laptop or desktop computer. The common schedule tool, and I, I'm in, yeah, I'm not affiliated with these guys at all. They, they're just great. It was all around great. So basically, you will be able to upload your photos, your, um, your downloaded photos that you download on your laptop. You'll be able to upload them directly to Instagram from your desktop. That's the beauty about it. So you don't have to manually make all of your posts. See, these, these three posts right here, I manually made all of these posts. But let's say if I want to go to downloadgram.com and I want to download 30 different photos onto my computer, well, I can go to the common scheduler and I can say I want one photo to be posted with hashtags and a description. You can write all that out. I want one photo to be posted every single day for a month. Well, you have, a, you have your account completely on autopilot because your content will be scheduled for the next month without you lifting a finger. Now, imagine having multiple profiles doing this for you. I highly recommend you focus on one profile at a time, but if you really want to scale things up, 
eventually you will get to multiple profiles. So once again, on Instagram, our whole entire goal is to grow our following and to start getting people interacting with our content. It's all about content. Now, month one, if you can't remember, I told you that you really don't have to post no photos, but month six is different when you are using Instagram for traffic because that's our number one focus content is just reposting other people's content and tagging the content creator or the owner of the content and, and using hashtags to be discovered through hashtags. That is the power and that's exactly what we will focus on on Instagram to start pulling in traffic, which return will pull in leads. Okay, so to recap what needs to be done to start banking, the first thing you want to do is choose your niche. Then you want to install GMAS. Remember, it's the Google Chrome extension. Then you want to choose your offer with AdWork Media or create an HQ template. Fourth, you want to create your landing page. Fifth, you want to build a niche targeted Instagram account. Then you want to grab the most attractive content from other users plus tag them. Then you want to repost to your new account using highly searched hashtags. You can automate with Common. This is completely optional because Common does charge a small monthly fee, so this is completely optional. You can simply repost the photos on your own after you download them. You don't have to use Common. That is completely optional, but it will help a whole lot. Last but not least, you want to boost interaction with your new account by following targeted users in your niche. That's all you have to do. Of course, Instagram is not the only thing you should do to build up your email list. You can also use Facebook, Pinterest, and even solo ads. It's completely up to you. Okay, so let's talk about solo ads. If you don't know about solo ads, solo ads is when a person has a list, a list of targeted people, and they will send an email for a certain price. They will send an email to their list for you. So what does this help you do? This helps you get basically as many leads as you will ever want or need. And all you have to do is simply give them the URL to your landing page. That's all you have to do. Solo ads are very simple and they're very powerful and effective. And that's how some marketers go from zero to $10,000 a month within a month by just spending a bunch of money on solo ads. Of course, solo ads are not free. You have to pay per click for every single Basically, for every single um, click or open that you get for your for your landing page, so if you if they send a link to a hundred people for every single click or open, you have to pay for that. And most of the time, it's clicks for every single click that you get. You have to pay for that. That's the crazy thing about solo ads because you can really get a boatload of traffic on demand with solo ads. I mean, I, I've been running them for many years now. I first heard about solo ads, I believe it was um, from a guy named a millionaire marketer, Dagan Smith. I'm pretty sure it's the first person I heard it from. And it, it just blows my mind how you can get instant traffic for your landing pages and just just sit back and relax while the, while the traffic flows in. So I'm on a site, I believe it's called Udemy. And it's not like, um, it's not spelled like the, um, the course platform Udemy is U D I M I Udemy. I believe that's how, that's how you pronounce it. So basically, once you get signed up with Udemy, and you can use my affiliate link. My affiliate link will be in the back office. And um, of course, once you sign up, you can become an affiliate also and earn a commission whenever people purchase a solo ad. But yeah, my affiliate link will be in the back office of the um, CPA Mastermind Group. So you can use my affiliate link to get signed up. But whenever you get signed up and verify your account, what you want to do is just click Find Sellers or Solo Deals, whichever one. I'm going to click Find Sellers. And what you want to look at, you want to look at the seller's feedback. 2,224 positive, 3 negative. That's a pretty good seller right there. 107, 2 negative, good seller, 27 positive. 1,100 positive, 1 negative. I mean, this is just crazy. Let's click on this guy right here. And we're going to see how much this guy charged. Okay. Let's say if I'm promoting my, let me go to my, get my landing page. And this is all you got to do right here. Let's say we're going to do Google Sites. Let's get my landing page link. 
And I can use the URL shortener also if I want to. Let's see. So here goes my landing page link right here. My Facebook where I'm giving away the free Facebook guide. Let me just publish it. View. Uh, here, let me copy my landing page link right here. And I'm going to paste right there. And basically what I can do is I can simply say, okay, instead of 200 visitors and paying $137, I only want 100 visitors and paying $70, which this is pretty steep for a solo. You know, usually you can get 100 um, visitors for like $40, and you got to basically do the math. If I'm paying $70 for 100 visitors, you got to say, okay, it's not going to make sense if a country is only paying a dollar per CPA lead. And, you know, kind of you, you kind of make money on the back end, but it's not really going to make too much sense to, um, let's say if um, you get paid a dollar lead and 40 people convert and you spent $70 for a solo ad, so you lost $30. But you will get emails in exchange, which, you know, that's how most money is um, made on the back end anyway. So it will be kind of up to you to measure that. But I wouldn't pay $70 for 100 visitors. I would pay $50 max for 100 visitors. But that's just this specific um, seller. And, of course, you could check out the price. Look at this guy right here. Look at this guy right here. 200 visitors. Yeah, this is much cheaper. 50 visitors. Look at that. $23. 50 visitors for $23. So if I want 100 visitors, $43. This is not beloved. If I want only top tier now, I got to pay 53. Only top tier is US, UK, Canada, and Australia. And of course, you get New Zealand and Singapore. These are only top tier people. So this is going to be your best traffic right here. Only top tier. And the only only prime, let's see. Only prime, they got that is better. Let's see. Let's see which one better. Okay, only top tier is better, I believe. Yeah, only top tier is better than um, prime filter. So that's all you have to do is simply find your seller, paste your landing page URL just like you see me do, and just click add to cart. And this is only if you are in the entrepreneur and make money space. I'm not sh really sure if they have other categories. I'm sure you might be able to find some help. Let's see, niches. Let's see, any niche. You might be able to find other niches, but okay, here we go. So you got crypto niche, you got the social niche, you got the mobile, health, uh, finance, marketing. So of course I would do the marketing and basically just choose your niche. Let's see. Okay. So yeah, it kind of got it niched out. If a person can deliver a certain, you know, targeted amount of traffic or um, targeted group of traffic, you're definitely going to have that person show up whenever you filter it out. So when it comes to Udemy, they have like an unlimited amount of traffic. This is one of the top spots for solo ads online. So it, once again, if you are in any of the niches that I told you and that I showed you just now, you can get traffic whenever you like, like instant traffic. So you you would even if unless you wanted to, you wouldn't have to focus on the Instagram method. You wouldn't have to focus on other social media met methods, Pinterest, Facebook, or whatever. You wouldn't have to focus on none of that if you want to pay for traffic and get the traffic immediately through something like Udemy. But I just wanted to show you this because this is something that I use and it's super powerful. So whatever you do, whenever you make money with CPA or if you want to start out with Udemy, definitely give this website a try and give solo ads a try overall because you're going to quickly find out how effective the traffic is with solo ads because it's simply on demand. It's super powerful and everybody that's doing online marketing, CPA marketing, internet marketing overall should definitely give solo ads a shot. Okay, here go some good items to give away. The first thing I would highly recommend is free PDF guides, trainings, and courses. There are so many guides out there. There's so many PDFs out there. There's so many trainings out there. You know, there's so much out there courses and all that you can simply find for free and give away. If you type in the name of a niche and put PDF on the end on Google, 
You can find free PDFs like crazy, or you can simply go to you know PLR website to get PDFs. But what I challenge you to do right now is go to Google and type in Make Money Online PDF. You will find free PDF guides that you can simply click on, grab the link, and that can be your giveaway guide or chicken recipe PDF or turkey recipe PDF. And you can take that PDF link and you can put it in the back office of your CPA grip account if you're doing HQ templates and you can lock that PDF, put a content locker over it and that will be your giveaway item. You can do tips and tricks. So if you have any tips on how to scale ad campaigns or how to get certain results online, you know, you can write those tips on a Word document and then save that Word document as a PDF and give those tips away. Same with tricks. If you know any kind of tricks that will help people, you can simply make a lot of money by giving away those tips and tricks. And also travel hacks. Travel is a billion dollar, if not trillion dollar industry. So there's so many travel hacks that you can think of, I'm sure, if you if you travel, or if you, even if you don't travel, I'm sure you can find some travel hacks to lock using a CPA grip HQ templates. Even if you are not using CPA Grips HQ templates, you're still going to have to give something away in order to build your email list. So if you're not willing to give nothing away, even if you find it free on Google, you're most likely not going to do good. You have to give as much as possible and give as much value as possible because people are not going to give you their name and email or only their email, whatever you ask them for. People are not going to give you that information unless you do give them something of value for free. So I highly recommend that you do this because once again, if you don't, you will be sorry in the end when it comes to seeing results. With CPA Grip, you can also use popular posts from others' blogs as giveaway items. So what I mean is you can find a blog post that's performing well, you can grab the link to that blog post, and you can put that in the back office of your HQ template with CPA Grip and whenever somebody completes an offer, they will be redirected to a blog post that's not even yours. I've done this plenty of times and made a lot of money by doing so. And in the end, the user is happy because they are accessing just what you are promising them. So always focus on giving items away because if you are not focused on giving items away, you might as well say you're not focused on making money. Okay, so what I'm showing you right now is how I find the hottest of the hottest blog posts on the web, I mean on the internet that's been shared a hundred thousand times or more. I go to a site called Buzzsumo. Buzzsumo is a place where you can basically zone in and zoom in on content that's been shared all over the web and you can just analyze data about these posts, see why these posts are doing so well and so on. So I never pay for Buzzsumo to be honest with you. Even though I should be paying for it, I'm just a person that hate paying you know, a bunch of monthly fees for a bunch of stuff. So I just kind of get a free trial every now and then just when I need it. And that's exactly what I use Buzzsumo for is to analyze content. So basically, this is something that you don't have to pay for if you don't want to. You know, like myself, I just go and, you know, get what I need and kind of just leave and come back when I need to. So basically, let's go ahead and type in a keyword. So once you get here, just type in a key keyword. So I'm going to type in keto diet. Okay, so I just typed in keto diet. Let's see what we find. Look at here. Look at the engagement on these posts right here. Over 272,000 shares right here on this specific post from the NewYorkPost.com. Right here, 195,000 shares on this site, Homemaking.com. 236,000 Pinterest shares on this post right here. So can you imagine how much money can be made and will be made by grabbing these posts that are already performing well, that have been seen by over 200,000 people, and that can be seen by 200,000 more people through your CPA offers? So this is a beautiful thing because I can simply click on this article right here. Let's go to it. I could click on an article, and what I could do is I could simply give people a sneak peek of what they are going to get. So let's say basically, um, 
let's say basically you just want to give people the first little bit of the article or if it's a recipe just give people the first little bit kind of tease them and then tell them if they want to read the full article to you know of course to complete your CPA grip content locker and that will be the PDF um, content locker the HQ template to complete the offer or fill out the offers if they want to access more and the, and then you will be hiding this link right here you will link this link them to this blog link that's not even yours in the first place that's the beautiful thing about this and people would deeply appreciate it because we see over 200,000 people already appreciate it. So this is a cool way I just wanted to show you uh, by using BuzzSumo how to find very popular content. Just grab the link and of course log into CPA Grip whenever it says locked URL. Just put this URL right here and you can change up the headline if you want to or you can make up your own. You know, um, change it up, keep the same, whatever. But just put that link right there or whatever your, your search term may be and you will be blown away with how much people will love what you are putting out. This is just a great free way to do this and it's super powerful and I just wanted to show you how powerful this really is. Remember, since we are focused on building up our email list, you must focus on growth of your list. This means the more emails you have on your list, the more money you will end up making. Also, by using this method, you can eventually put your marketing efforts on 100% autopilot. Congratulations, I am so excited that you completed this month's training. This month is a cool month because you can simply put all of your email marketing on autopilot eventually. Imagine having a list of 10,000 people and counting, and you are constantly emailing your list multiple CPA offers so they can gain multiple freebies. It's a never-ending cycle of win-win situation because the person on the other end is receiving something for free by simply completing a new CPA offer, even if it's the same person every single month or the same people every single month. If they complete those CPA offers, they will get what's on the other end of the CPA offers. Of course, you want to always, always, always send them new materials and not send them the same stuff because people will um, stop completing stuff. But as long as you send them new materials, you will be good to go. I am super excited that you completed this month because it's a month that means a lot. It's a month that a lot of marketers follow to make their first million dollars online, to even make their first $10 online. So email marketing is super powerful whenever you are providing value and taking it serious. Congratulations once again on finishing month six, and I am really looking forward to seeing you on month seven and beyond. So take the time and give yourself a pat on the back because you really deserve it. You've been in this game for a half a year. I am super proud of you as your coach, as your mentor, and there's so much more to come with the CPA Mastermind Group, and I am looking forward to watching you succeed on a completely different level.